and this is a instrument with two manuals and pedal built by James Louder of um, Montreal, Canada. Mr. Louder served for several years as the uh, shop foreman for Helmut Wolf and Associates, a uh, real kind of primo uh, Canadian organ builder. And uh, he went independent uh, in about the year 2000. And uh, I got this instrument in 2003. Um, when a builder goes solo, of course, he kind of has to start over again. I was the lucky one because of the fact that uh, as a solo builder and new to the trade, um, he was charging much less than his instruments are worth. Uh, so I probably couldn't have bought this if he'd had uh, the reputation of his former employer, Helmut Wolf. Fact is, though, I get a first class instrument. As I said, this instrument has five stops. We have an open flute on the pedal. And a beautiful eight foot principle on the lower keyboard. On the upper keyboard, what's called a boudon, more fluty sound. I also have a four foot flute that I can use on either keyboard. And lastly, but not least, uh, I call it my box of ducks. It's what they call a regal or a regal stop, and it's a snarling little short resonator reed. And an interesting feature of this organ is that I can take this reed stop because it is divided and I can play with an inert color in my left hand, but with the regal in the right hand. And I can reverse that process and do exactly the same thing uh, opposite-wise. Hey, what's going on? Since I like to play a lot of Castilian organ music, uh, the divided registers are a very important thing. Um, and maybe what I'll do is leave us with a Bach fantasy on this instrument. This is the BWV 542 Fantasy in G minor.
Of course, pedal playing like this comes from mostly Northern Europe. I've always theorized that you had to eat animal fat and play with all your appendages to stay warm in German churches in the summer, or the winter rather. Um, but uh, I do most of my practicing on this instrument and it continues to make a better player out of me. It's uh, very exacting. Um, it's all mechanical except for the wind supply which uh, electricity is gratefully given to us.